Hi Virgo, this is my channel Psychic Love Tarot. Welcome to my channel. On this channel, I do tarot readings for the people from all around the world in English language. So please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Right now, I'm going to do a reading for Virgo people that what will happen from 15th of March to the 31st of March 2022. What I'm going to do is first I'm going to pull out a cross spread from this tarot deck and we'll see what will happen overall. And after that, in the same video, I'm going to pull some cards out for love life of Virgo people. And after that, in the same video, I'm going to pull some extra messages from the Gypsy deck. So watch the video till the end so you get all the messages. And if you want to buy a personal reading with me, I do these readings on video call Skype. So if you're interested, you can just add me on Skype and we'll take you from there. My Skype ID is written on the screen right now. You can book a personal reading by adding me on Skype. Uh, through this ID written on the screen. So let's start shuffling, Virgo. Okay. Messages for Virgo, 15th to 31st of March. Messages for Virgo, 15th to 31st of March. Messages for Virgo, 15th to 31st of March. Messages for Virgo. 15th to 31st of March. Messages for Virgo. 15th to 31st of March. Okay, Virgo. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So, uh, the first card we have is Justice. So Virgo, you have made some kind of a very firm decision right now. You're making some kind of decision or you have made some kind of decision, a uh, very balanced, very firm decision. For some of you, maybe you're ready to cut out somebody or some situation out of your life, which is not serving you anymore. And it can be some other decision also for some of you. Uh, because you have been waiting for something. We have hangman in the background. And then the, in this waiting um, area or waiting time, your mind change, your perspective change, your way of thinking, your... Uh, uh, yeah, something changed in your mind. There was a mind change and you made some kind of decision. Before we have page of swords, so you have been analyzing something, some situation, you have been keeping an eye on somebody and uh, you have been having your doubts in some situation. Uh, there was a situation and uh, you were not sure about it, you were deeply analyzing it and you had your doubts. But I think now you are clear and you have made some kind of decision. Uh, on your mind is eight of pentacles. So you have work on your mind. It, if you are not working, you are a house person or a housewife, then it's work of the house, things at the house. Or if you work, then you are uh, working a lot and uh, you are focused on your, your work and practical side of things. Uh, you don't want to waste any more of your time and you want to be practical, be uh, work oriented and uh, uh, for and work for your stability and finances. Underneath we have seven of wands. So you in your heart space, you are defending your heart, your feelings and yourself. You don't want to be vulnerable. Things are, challenges are in the way, but you are protecting your heart. Uh, you are very defensive about your feelings or any emotional situation. So you're defensive, you're defending yourself. Now what's coming towards you is six of swords. So in the second half of uh, uh, March, you're going to come out of darkness and you're going to enter the light. You're going to be at peace. You'll no more be restless or agitated. Uh, you'll be very relaxed, very calm. Some of you will travel in March. 
so it's a travel or travel also coming for some of you but overall i think you're gonna be peaceful some of you will move on from one situation to the other situation like you leave behind one situation it can be in love it can be in work it can be in anything so you leave one situation behind and you'll move towards a better situation so overall i think you're gonna be at peace and you're gonna come into your positive energy in the second half of march okay three cards for six of swords three cards for six of swords three cards for six of swords one two and three uh hangman four of wands and six of wands so yeah again your mind is gonna change and you're gonna move forward uh you uh, you are gonna end some kind of uh fight or struggle in your life and you'll feel that you have reached home you have reached your destination you're gonna get some kind of success in the second half of march some of you will get some kind of fame or recognition in march um and uh in some situation of your life uh, you're gonna uh, like uh, get promoted to the next level or you're gonna take some situation of your life uh, to the next level uh, so basically uh, second half of March uh, Virgo is very positive for you whatever will happen it's gonna be in your own benefit and for your own good and it's going to make you peaceful it's going to give you peace and uh, you will feel uh, much lighter and uh, much better and uh, your perspective and your way of thinking is going to change uh, before uh, whatever uh, thought patterns you had uh, they all are going to change in the second half of march now let's pull some love messages for you Love messages for Virgo, 15th to 31st of March. Love messages for Virgo, 15th to 31st of March. Love messages for Virgo, 15th to 31st of March. Okay, Virgo, 1, 2 and 3. So, Hierophant. So some of you, uh, uh, there was something about your marriage which was bothering you uh, before. But now I think things are uh, fine there uh, too or you have taken some kind of decision. Uh, well, whatever you were feeling about your, it can be a marriage, it can be a commitment, committed relation also. Whatever you, you were feeling, I think you have... Uh, uh, now controlled your emotions and you don't open up a lot about your emotions now you keep them in but then after that we have two pages here page of cups and page of wands so for lots of you you are gonna have two options in the second half of march we have two characters here and these both are initial energies uh so of course it's a general reading the situation can be any situation and of course situations will be different but you are gonna have love and intimacy around you in the second half of march and there are two options for you for lots of you uh, and if there are not two options for some of you then uh, even then things are gonna be happening in your love life intimacy is gonna happen love is gonna happen in your love life but it's it's small and it's initial it's like a beginning uh, for some of you it can be two beginnings also uh, so it's looking good Virgo <laughs> I think it's a positive uh, time for you the second half of March and I think you're gonna be uh, sorting out lots of things in your life now let's pull some extra messages from this gypsy deck um, with these messages extra messages you have to keep that in mind they are not going to resonate with everybody so if they don't resonate don't worry much about it uh, and just leave it okay 
Uh, what else for Virgo 15th to 31st of March? What else for Virgo 15th to 31st of March? What else for Virgo 15th to 31st of March? Okay, Virgo. One, two and three. Sadness. So you're sad, Virgo. Uh, or you were sad. But I think you still carry that sadness energy. Uh, you're not completely contentment and happiness and joy satisfaction no i think you are a little bit sad inside some of you are having some health issues with this malady in the background some of you are having some health issues um, uh, so maybe that's also keeping you down uh, but uh, there is some sadness around you uh, uh, but then we have officer uh, so i think you're gonna uh, come out of this sadness in the second part of march uh, and then uh, here also again we have two characters, officer and uh, lover. Uh, so definitely in your love life there is going to be something happening uh, and uh, your love life is going to move forward in the second half of March in a very, very positive way. So please hit the button like if you like the video and give me a thumbs up. You can subscribe to my channel if you like what I do. And thank you so much for watching the video. Stay blessed always.